Hello and welcome to this video where we'll be taking you through the steps to connecting your Samsung Note 10 Plus to a TV. Although the Note 10 Plus already has a larger screen size compared to the Note 10, there are still many benefits to projecting your screen onto your TV. There are many different methods to connecting your phone to your TV, from directly linking your phone via HDMI cable to casting to the nearest smart TV or casting device. But not everyone can be tech savvy, and some just can't afford the latest smartphone or gadget that allows you to watch videos or view pictures wirelessly. With the release of the Note 10 Plus, we've taken two of our best USB-C to HDMI adapters to show you how to connect your phone to your TV easily while showcasing how well the official adapter works against the non-brand alternatives. First we'll be taking a look at the official Samsung HDMI adapter. With it being an official Samsung product, there's always that guarantee that it'll work effortlessly with your Samsung device, which makes it worth the added cost for the brand name. Inside the box you'll find the cable along with the handy quick start guide if you need any additional information, but using this cable is pretty self-explanatory and has very few steps to getting it set up. For this one you'll need a HDMI to HDMI cable to connect to the back of your TV as the adapter ends in a female port. To start, simply plug your USB-C end into your phone port. Connect the HDMI cable to the end of the adapter, and if you haven't already, insert the other end of the HDMI into the HDMI port on the back of your TV. Now all you need to do to complete the process is selecting the correct HDMI output on your TV, making sure your phone is unlocked and you're ready to go. Though you need a HDMI cable to use it, it works really well in the home as it allows you to utilise HDMI cables that are already compatible to your TV. If you already own a gaming console, Blu-ray player, projector or computer that's already connected to the TV, there's no need to purchase a new HDMI. You simply have to disconnect one that you're not using and reattach to your phone with very little setup. The adapter itself is quite small and short, which is perfect for wall-mounted TVs. TVs that have very little space around the back for protruding cables. It also supports 4K video output, allowing you to watch full resolution YouTube videos or Netflix with complete clarity. For a non-branded option, we have the Gube USB-C to HDMI adapter. Between this and the official adapter, there are very little differences. Whereas the official cable holds the top price tag, this adapter costs half as much and works very similarly in terms of functionality and features. There's no need to find out a separate HDMI for this adapter, as it already comes with an inbuilt plug-and-play HDMI connector that plugs directly into the back of your TV. With this one, plug the USB-C end into your phone port as usual, and then complete the connection by plugging the other end into the available HDMI port on the back of your TV. Again, check you're on the correct HDMI output to begin mirroring your phone to your screen. The plus side of this type of adapter is the ability to connect your phone to the display wherever you go. Whether that's on the TV in a hotel room or on a friend's laptop, it gives you the freedom to share your phone with multiple people without crowding around a small phone screen. Compatible with 4K screen resolution, this adapter will work great for streaming high resolution videos and keep up with your phone's high quality display. Of course the HDMI adapter is quite large so it may make it difficult connecting to the ports in tight spaces, but the plus side is the very long cable, meaning you can sit comfortably away from the screen while navigating apps and pausing video. On top of using the HDMI connection to mirror your phone screen, you can also use this adapter to make use of Samsung's DeX PC experience. By connecting the HDMI, you can create a desktop PC workstation on any HDMI display for a more comfortable, portable working environment. With the Samsung DeX, you can use your phone just like a desktop PC, allowing you to write documents and emails, as well as stream YouTube, view photos and browse online. It loads automatically when the HDMI connects to the TV, and you can navigate the screen using your phone as a touchpad. Though very useful for completing everyday tasks on a much larger screen, it's not too dissimilar from the screen mirroring feature. As with every casting device or cable connection to a display, playing your phone through another device does consume a lot of battery power. Unfortunately, using the cable method means you can't charge your phone through USB-C while screen mirroring. But if you really need that little extra power boost, you can use a wireless charger while the phone is connected to the TV for that extra viewing time of your favourite shows. So that's all there is to it when connecting your Note 10 Plus to a TV using a USB-C to HDMI adapter. Whether looking for the best adapter for the job or simply looking for a good visual instruction on how to connect your device, I hope you've enjoyed this quick how-to. And if you're looking for more mobile tech reviews and the latest mobile news, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more great content. Thanks for watching.